Hey YouTube, it's a late night video on the CRX. Should you sell your CRX in 2023? What is going on? Prices on these cars is absolutely, are absolutely bonkers right now. Um, if you're watching this video and you own one or you've been looking for one, the prices on these cars have gone out of control. And I would say that probably about a lot of cars and a lot of imports, but particularly the CRX and the second gen uh, of these uh, is what the most of the sales are. Um, if you go to bring a trailer or one of those types of auction sites or classic.com, you can track the prices and I own one. So I just keep track of prices um, and it's just crazy how expensive really everything's getting. But I want to just say this this car in particular the prices these are fetching is it's just insane so i saw one for sale a few minutes ago that looks almost identical to mine i don't think it's a jdm well i know it's not a jdm it, it's a regular um usdm spec with the steering wheel on the left um, but it looks very similar it's the same uh, uh red torino pearl color and it has some cool wheels and it's in really nice shape and it, it is an si um it's just not the uh the JDM right-hand drive, um, like mine is, but it kind of prompted me to think, and no, I am not uh, anywhere close to selling this, but, you know, the discussion on the Facebook group was like, hey, you know, is it time to sell? And I just got to thinking, like, why would you sell it? Um, and so I thought I'd shoot a quick video here. Um, and it's, again, it's late at night, but I uh, am uh, thought it would be fun to have some discussion. So, um, you know, I got a printout here. Um, I just old school, so I, I print stuff out instead of um, layer in the picture. Um, but this just shows you the, man, the prices on these. It's just crazy. So I just did a quick search on Bring a Trailer and 85 has sold since 2017. That's 2017, 2018, 19, 20, 21, 22, and then January 23. And there's the price tiers starting here at 5,000 all the way up to 40,000. And these dots each represent a car that sold. And so, you know, obviously you can do this search yourself. But the point of this video is, I mean, if you look here and, um, you know, we'll just take my architect's ruler here. $10,000, we'll start here at the 5,000. And again, this is just bring a trailer, but it's crazy. I mean, I remember guys like back in 2017, 16, 15, I mean, you could get an old Prelude, a CRX. I mean, you could get a really decent car for five, six, seven thousand dollars $7,000 or less. Nowadays, forget it. I mean, it's crazy. Look at the prices. So, I mean, we're starting right here, 5,000, got all these dots, you go up to 10,000, you go up to 15,000 still at 15,000. I mean, you still have like half of the cars sold for over 15, $15,000, 20,000, 25, and then 30 and up. You still have one, two, three, six cars, $30,000 for a CRX. These cars were low mileage cars in very good shape, but still. That is a ton of money. And I'm just going to say in the last three or four months, I've been watching the Bring a Trailer auctions and there's there's been seven or eight of these that have sold. Um, and they're selling for fifteen, twenty, twenty-five thousand dollars $25,000. So, you know, is it time to sell yours? Um, you know, lots of us in the, in the you know, even some like really well-known uh, members that have been in the community a long time are selling theirs. And... Um, so, I, you know, I thought it'd be interesting to post a video, a short video on this. And, um, you know, I made a video a couple of months ago when I sold my Fiesta ST, which took this spot in my garage. Um, by the way, the PT Cruiser GT is, I've had it for two months now. It's absolutely amazing. Unbelievable. Just did the Mopar Stage 1 tune. And... Uh, it is incredible what you get for a few thousand dollars in these cars. That's all I'm going to say. Wife's out of town right now, so it, the PT got the garage. Uh, Insight can't have the garage. He might explode with the lithium battery, so he stays outside. He's very happy there. But um, in any case, what I was saying was just the CRXs are, um, you know, the, the kind of the bottom line to me is like, 
if you need the money, sell it. Because this car right now, JDM, has 118,000 miles. Cold air, great shape, good paint, awesome wheels, lots of aftermarket, tasteful stuff like the HKS exhaust. You know, this car is probably eighteen, twenty, twenty-two thousand dollar car. Um, seats aren't ripped, interior is near perfect. So yeah, if you need the money, sell it, man. Like now's the time. There's no telling what's gonna happen with the automotive um, you know, the market with stuff. And you know, there's newer JDM imports coming in every year with the twenty-five year loss. So these, yes, will remain rare, but there's all kinds of other options coming. If you need the money, sell it. If you don't, I'd say don't. Um, I made this video a few months ago when I sold the Fiesta. These were my eight reasons I decided to sell it. I never drove it. Keeping it perfect was stressful. Um, I didn't care about being badass anymore, like having the super fast car. Uh, wanted someone else to enjoy it. Uh, it was worth a lot of money. That was part of my decision, but very, very, very little. Wanted room for another car. Um, you know, the nostalgia, what it symbolized was dead. And then just wanting change and all eight of those things for me went into selling the fiesta but this car is different those none of those categories really fit to me it's the bottom line is like i don't need the money so there is nothing like this and i guess if you're watching this my closing thought here is like yeah like crx's are fetching a lot of money if, if you need the money and you don't really drive the car a lot now is a great time to cash in um plus you know these break not often but when some breaks and it's hard to fix, uh, you know, it's an old car. So, uh, so yeah, if you need the money cash in. But if you don't, there is nothing, there is nothing like a CRX. And having owned about 50 cars, I can say that pretty confidently. So thanks for watching. Curious on your feedback. Give me some comments later.